Uh, this question you may solve by substitute some angle values and then find the num uh, numerical result and then see which option match your results. Uh, and then here I'm just explaining the traditional method. Uh, now we have two items we need to handle. The first one is cosine 90 degree plus theta. So uh, first this one is related to yS at 90 degree here. So we have to change the form and 90 degree plus theta is here. Uh, which is sine region but we have cosine here so when we transform it it will become negative and then because it's related to y axis so cosine will change to sine theta and then after that uh sine 360 degree minus theta so this is 360 degree minus theta is related to x asset so you don't need to change the format it's still sine theta but the problem is it's at the region of cosine so this will become negative uh then we simplify both parts then we can continue our calculation this one is equal to minus sine theta plus one and then negative sine theta minus one uh Expand it, you will get sine square theta minus 1. And then uh, this will become 1 minus cosine square theta minus 1. And then minus cosine square theta will be the answer. Uh, some of you may not be understand why this will become this one. So I'm now going to demonstrate. It's because of the identity. Sine square theta plus cosine square theta will be equal to 1. Uh, pay extra attention whether these two angles are the same and it's why we have this identity is because of Pythagoras theorem now we want sine square theta then we make it become subjects we have 1 minus cosine square theta so that's why just now I changed this format to this format it's because I want to uh, create one to eliminate this term and then we have one term only and we think this is more uh, simplified results the answer is a